Hi, good evening to all. Today's topic is all about the problems of the small scale industry. It is an important topic of the tourism and entrepreneurship. So we will look at the meaning of the small scale industry or SSI. It refers to an industry in which the investment in plant and machinery does not exceed 1 crore. <coughs> Small scale, small scale industry na those industries na those industries investment in plant and machinery within one crore those industries are called na SSI. Problems are as follows: the first one shortage of finance. Shortage of finance is the serious problem faced by SSIs. It is because of the scarcity of capital and a low na institutional credit, credit that is from banks. The first problems faced by SSIs na is na shortage of finance. This problem arises na because of the scarcity of capital and the inadequate finance from institutional credit agencies. Next problem is the SSIs that depend upon the local market for the materials. They purchase small quantity at a higher prices and cannot bear the cost of production. Most of the SSIs na <coughs> depend on the local market na for their the supply, for their the purchasing materials. They purchase a small quantity na high prices na, that cannot afford by the SSIs. <coughs> the third na, problem is na, SSIs are not utilized to their full capacities. The reasons are lack of raw materials, finance and the shortage of power. As a result, their products are unable to compete with large scale industries. SSIs na, don't na, fully na, utilized na, SSI is not owned the fully utilized their na capacities. The reasons behind this na are lack of raw materials, finance under the shortage of power. That's why they cannot the compete with large scale industries. <coughs> the fourth one is na SSIs are the stick to use of old and outdated methods of production. They are not using modern technology because it is expensive which leads to high cost of production and poor quality of goods. SSIs na don't na follow the modern technology because na it has na it doesn't have the finance that much that leads to a high cost of production and a poor quality of goods. That's why they produce a poor quality of goods. The fifth one is the SSIs are not in a position to get latest and updated market information related to consumer tastes, fashions and likes. These industries fail to be competitive with large scale industries to sell their products because of poor quality that to high prices and occur losses. <coughs> SSIs na don't get the <coughs> chance na to receive the information, na, to receive the market information, na, the latest na information na, of the consumer taste sufficient and likes. Because na, SSIs na don't the involve large na scale in the industries market. These industries have failed to na competitive 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 with large scale industries because it doesn't have the it doesn't have good quality. That's why the they occur losses. Lack of infrastructure adversely affect the functioning of SSIs. Available infrastructure is very poor, especially transport, power, communication, etc. 
poor infrastructure creates working problems and that affect the quality and the quantity of production which further leads to huge loss <coughs> SSIs not don't have the infrastructure facility that will affect the, their functioning of the, their functioning whatever the available the infrastructure that's also very poor especially transport power communication these poor infrastructure creates working problems in terms of quality and quantity of a production which further the leads to a huge loss to the SSIs. Due to limited the financial resources, the SSIs don't study the demand aspect, marketing problems, sources of raw materials and available of infrastructure facilities before starting their the projects. SSIs don't have the enough finance that's why they cannot uh, study the demand aspect uh, marketing problems uh, sources of raw materials and the infrastructure facilities before starting their uh, projects the main reason they don't have finance SSIs uh, face the problem of uh, skilled workers they may not afford to pay the wages to skilled workers SSIs are uh, incorporated with the uh, unskilled workers only because they cannot recruit recure, uh, skilled workers if so they will pay a uh, lot of salary to them <coughs> the next one is many SSIs have turned sick uh, due to lack of managerial skills to run a business successfully skills training counseling are essential which are lacking in SSIs Lot of SSIs na <coughs> have turned sicknesses because they don't have the enough managerial skills. In order to run a business successfully, na, we need na, enough skills, training, counseling, which are missing in SSIs. SSIs have most important role in economic development in terms of employment creation and eradication of poverty. But most of the SSIs now become sick. It is due to lack of planning, unskilled labor, huge debts under the old technologies. SSIs plays a great role in economic development. The growth of economic depends upon the SSIs development only. SSIs now create a lot of the employment opportunities for people and the eradication of a power, poverty in the economy. But most of the SSIs have become sick nowadays. It is due to the lack of a planning. They don't have enough planning, unskilled labor, unavailability of unskilled labor, unavailability of unskilled labor, and a huge debts now from the institutions and the world technologies now they follow still thank you we will see you again with another session until then stay tuned stay blessed bye